And some Placerville restaurants are about to get national attention. Yeah, celebrity chef Guy Fieri's new TV show is featuring them. CBS 13's Shelby Riley shows us. I knew that it was worthy of that, um, but you don't think, you know, that you're going to have Food Network come through your town. Rocker Oyster Feller sits in downtown Placerville and is one of the six restaurants set to be in an episode of Guy Fieri's new show, The Best Bite in Town. In just two weeks, a number of local restaurants will make their debut on the Food Network, including some right here on Main Street, and they will compete for the best bite in Placerville. Main Street's a very small community. If you work here and you patron all the places here, it, you're in this community. Um, so we all support each other very much, so we're excited to have a little friendly competition. Fox says they had no idea if they would even be selected for the episode, but figured it would be a great opportunity to draw more attention to Placerville. But I think it's going to really bring attention to Main Street, and we have a lot of great food all up and down Main Street, not just our restaurant. Just a few miles down the road is the Smith Flat House, who will also be featured in the episode. Owner Mason Antonucci says he didn't believe it was real at first when he got the email about the Food Network looking for restaurants in Placerville. Uh, a little hope and dreams always, but uh, never thought it would come to reality. So it was a pretty cool experience. All having the goal of showcasing the wonderful food Placerville has to offer. At the end of it all, we're all walking away feeling a little more bonded and united. Some bragging rights for all of Main Street. Gosh, and so much good attention. Other restaurants featured include the Placerville Public House, a more Mio Italian Bistro, and Enchanted Forest Dining Experience. So to find out who wins, you can watch the episode airing April 26th at 9 o'clock.